Hello everybody, JJMessero4002 here with a Minecraft Sprint Parkour map. This map is called Sprintable, and this is the Potion Swag Automatic 69000 machine. Step here for option potion effects. And gave me speed too. Um, so I'm going to be doing something kind of different this round, uh, this time. I'm going to go through this sprint parkour map. If I didn't mention it, the sprint parkour map is called Sprintable. I'm not sure who it's by. Um, on the Minecraft forums, it didn't say, it didn't really specify the creator. Um, but I found this um, option. If I go into options and then video settings, I'm using Optifine, so that's why I have a whole bunch of other settings. But this thing called 3D Anaglyph um, turns it turns your Minecraft world so that it's in the red and blue, like, overlapping, um, well, I'll just show you, it's kind of hard to say, in this weird red and blue, um, vision. If you put on these, the 3D, like, the old 3D glasses that have the red lens and the blue lens, if you put them on, it makes it 3D, and I think it looks really cool. So I thought it'd be great, like, doing a sprint parkour map with this, um, with this effect on. So, but first, like I said, I'm going to do it um, without the 3D on, and be, because some people might not have those types of glasses, um, and I don't want them to, like, like have to see that weird vision without the 3D thing on, glasses on. So I'm going to do it in normal, and then I'm going to do it again in this 3D mode, and I'm going to be wearing 3D glasses myself. And, um, anyone who has 3D glasses is welcome to put them on and watch, because I thought it looked really cool. Um, so, let's get right into it. And, go! Oh, I guess it turned it to night. I really like this map because it goes with the environment. Like, it's, it's, a, he didn't, the creator, I'm assuming it's a he. Okay, the creator didn't have to, um like, change a whole bunch of the environment, which I think is awesome. And this, I think, oh, crap. Fell. Let me go back to my last jump. And... <laughs> Oops, I cheated. Um... And the, um... What am I trying to say? Sorry, I'm too focused on the park board to speak. Um... No, honestly, I'm too focused on the parkour to speak. Oops, we got the vine. I guess we're just going to follow the gold blocks now. Also, um, I- whoa, that lag. Um, I played this, um, one time before as a test run, and it's a fairly long map, which I thought was great, so, um... This should keep you entertained for a while. And jump. Why did I miss that again? And jump. Thank you. No. Okay. Okay. I got out of that. Going up a ladder. Wait, nope, we should just keep on going straight. <laughs> Probably all you're hearing right now is my space bar just getting hit over and over. Oh, I almost I almost over jumped that. Pew, 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 pew. Oh crap, I knew I wasn't going to miss that, I messed that jump up. Nope. Come on. I missed the <laughs> lily pad. Okay, whatever. It's all emeraldy. We're jumping on hoppers. That's like, that's a new... I've never done a parkour on hoppers before, but seems legit. Click for more parkour. 
Smiley face. Smiley face. Oh, oh, I almost messed that up. Ah, I did mess that up. Thought I was gonna do it flawlessly. Come on! What's wrong with me? Let's go. Oh, and also, um, the 3D setting that I'm gonna go to, um, after this round, it's not a, um, it's not a Optifine setting. It's in normal Minecraft, um, and I believe it came, it came, it got added to the settings, um, since 1.7. Can I please make this jump? <sighs> Apparently no, I can't. <laughs> and go. There we go. Nope. Okay, I don't know. Apparently I can't fly either. My goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm going to start crying. Ah, here. What the heck? I can't get more than one jump down. My goodness. Huh. Okay, I think we're on the last stretch. Oh, crap. Mm, I knew I wasn't going to make that right as I stepped on this platform thing. Oh, I almost had that. Why am I doing so horrible? Come on. Thanks for playing Sprintable. I really hope you enjoyed. I think I did. This is a pretty cool map. Except for the fact that I could not jump. Um, Tag Green Productions. I guess that's the creator. Tag Greens. I feel like he probably should have put that at the beginning of the map, but whatevs. Um, and I will see you next time in the 3D mode. Okay, I'm back, and I am going to switch into the 3D mode now. Um... It'll take a little while to lo load. Here we go. I'm putting on my 3D glasses now. And at first it will look a little bit disorientating. It did that for me the first time. Like, I couldn't play with these glasses on for, like, more than five minutes. It was, like, really disorientating. But look, everything looks so 3D. It's really cool. So let's step here again for Ashum Potion Effects. I'm saying Ashum because that's how it's spelled. Ashum. And let's go. Second time's charm. It is a lot harder to do it because you have to, it's hard to, like, piggy. It's hard to like, calculate the jump sometimes with this 3D effect on. No. See, like, I thought I made that, but it's, the 3D effects were like, nope. <laughs> So, leave in the comments if you think this effect is cool. Um, I think it is. Um, and I would like to do more parkour maps with this 3D effect on. Um, it just looks really cool, really awesome. Um, now the colors, a lot of the colors are not for real. Like, uh, I mean, you can't really tell that's glow. I mean, you can tell that's glowstone by the texture. Um, but you can't really tell the colors of it. But whatever. It's close enough. And also, by the way, if any of you guys were wondering, um, I am using a texture pack. The texture pack is called Faithful. Um, it, I believe it's a fairly popular texture pack. Um, basically, instead of Minecraft blocks being eight eight by eight pixels, so a total of sixty four pixels, it's um, thirty two by thirty two pixels. So it's a much more like high definition. Um, which, I, I don't like the texture packs that, like, ruin the look of Minecraft. Like, I just think that's kind of dumb. If I wanted to play, um, Minecraft, I would want it to look like Minecraft, is my, is my thing. Um, but this texture pack makes it, like, kind of HD quality, and I really like that. So, um, once I found this texture pack, I've been using it ever since, and I've been using it for, like, a couple months now.
It was really cool. I really like the 3D effect. And it's actually kind of scary when you're falling. Like right now. <laughs> I missed that jump. Let's keep on going. I also think, you'll see in a little bit in the water part, but I really think how the 3D of the water goes, it, it looks pretty cool. Like, look at that. The, it looks like the blocks actually have depth underneath the water. Like, see? I think that looks pretty cool. Now, when you actually go in the water, uh, it doesn't it doesn't look that great. Because it's dark underneath there and the red and blue crossing um, of the 3D effect um, doesn't, like, do so well underneath there. But I think it's pretty cool. I wonder how many times I can say this 3D effect is pretty cool in this video. And like this emerald block, you can tell it's green, but it's like not its true green color. So that's the only like problem I would have with it, but it's pretty hard to get true color when you have, when the primary colors are red and blue of the 3D effect. Click here for more parkour. And I like how the hub, like, all the hub, like, all this time is, like, way in front of all the, um, blocks and stuff. I think that's really cool. So let's keep on going. And see, these redstone blocks are obviously supposed to be red, but they just look, like, black right now because of the red color, coloring. Oh, 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 no, I thought I was going to do this. Keep on going like that. Nope. Okay. Knew that one was not going to make it. And the thing behind a sprint parkour map, if you've never seen it before, is you're not really supposed to stop much. Like, if you miss a jump, I use the um, system where you just fly back to, where, to the last jump you made. Um, but um, some people, like, will stop redo, jump, stop. I don't like that. It's a sprint parkour. You're supposed to sprint through it. So I try to do it continuously. And then if I mess up, I'll go back and fit, um, make the jump. But here we go. Thanks for playing Sprint Ball again. I really hope you enjoyed it. I really did, especially in this 3D effect. Punch a flower. Oh crap, I broke the, I broke the rules. I don't, dandelion. I hope, that, I hope that was the right flower. <laughs> um, and check this guy out on his YouTube channel. Uh, Teh Greens. Whatever. Um, thanks for watching, everybody. And I'll see you next time.